Alright, what is going on guys? And we are back at it with Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So guys, right where we left off was we did that quest where we uh, helped out Hunwald uh, re uh, reclaim uh, Lincolnshire. So right now, we are about to start a brand new quest. So let's get after it. I want to see the Alliance map. Uh... Tell me about Jorvik. Hytham says there are three more targets there. If that is true, you are in luck. Our old friends Jor and Ljuvina have made their homes in Jorvik. Both had status and influence in Norway, so they may have valuable insights into the city's politics. That would make my work easier. What say you then? Let's do it. I will go now. Do you know where I might find Hjor and Lufina? When entering a new city, it is best to ask around the ports. The people there know more than the average peasant. Alright guys, we are just gonna fast travel on over. This must be Jorvik. The Order of Ancients lurk in its streets and alleys. My old friends Jor and Lufina live here. Alrighty. Guys, this is gonna be exciting. Because right now, for the Order, we, uh, three more targets. So it's, got either, it's either gonna be these three or these three. Which I'm excited to uh, take out. <laughs> Pure and Lufina settled near this harbor. Someone should know where to find them. My friend, could you help me find some of my people? I'm looking for Hjor and Lufina. Hjor? I know him. Are you a friend? I am. Then you will get no help from me, or any of the other merchants for that matter. Now, if you don't mind. Hmm. Bitter. Has Hjor wronged him somehow? I'm looking for some friends. Been told to ask around this harbor. Lufina and Hjor. <laughs> oh, sure, I know plenty. Of that, I'm certain. Well, she has no help. Little one, can you help me? I'm looking for some friends. Do the names Hjor and Lufina mean anything to you? Mm. I think I know that name. A woman. She's from Biami land. Very smart. She sounded funny, so I asked her once. Hope it wasn't rude of me. You want to speak to the dot master, Grigory? I've seen him talking with her before. My thanks. Oh! And what about me? Move along now! We ran a clean dock in Jorvik. What the heck? You might be one of the guys I need to kill. You must be the dock master. What gave it away? Everyone hates you. As I just explained to your friend there, if your wares have been seized, take it up with the council. These merchants are not my friends, but I'm looking for some. Hjor, Lufina. You know Hjor and Lufina? What business do you have with them? They know each other from Norway. Bid farewell to that land, but not to old friends. 
You may be glad to hear they fare quite well in Jorvik. It does not surprise me. They're driven. And so am I. Now I would like to see them again. In a manor surrounded by flowers. That's where Hjor and Yufina live. How about some coin for my trouble? How about I cut out your tongue? Forget I said anything. Good response. Great response. The manor. Kyo and Lufina have done well for themselves. Keep your coin pouch close to you. I cannot wait for the Yuletide feast. Snow, I wine, food. Let's see you, old friend. Holy crap, they got a big house. Another large house. Yeah, this is their home. Oh no. The place has been ransacked. And this body. It's not your or Lufina. Scattered scrolls. The thief was looking for something. Dude, for a second I was like, are they dead? There was a struggle here. Looks like it continued outside. Blood, but no body. Which way did they go? Is this one of the thieves? Hmm. The trail continues. It's me, Lufina. It's Eivor. Eivor? What? Who sent you? Are you with them? Breathe, Lufina. You're rattled. You know me. I am a friend. Are you? You show up here like this. These people tried to kill me. Can we deal with this later? It's not safe here. Sorry, Eivor. I did not mean to doubt you. It has been a tense few weeks. Who were they? Why were they after you? They were after this. I do not know what it is, but these men were ready to kill me for it. A poor fellow soldier of Christ. You know him? I've seen a letter like this before, in London. This city is in great danger. Where's your? At the Royal Hall. I will take you there. Pull up your hood. We may not be safe just yet. Won't be gentle if they spot me. This way. All right. They are still looking for me. Hide low. We can slip past them. I've gotten far. Look around. Let's go. Hey! 
What? I think it is safe now. Gods, Eivor. Your arrival could not be better timed. Call it fate. I had hoped our paths would cross again, though I imagined a calmer reunion. We fled one problem only to find ourselves embroiled in another. While King Richier is preoccupied with the money shortage, a group called the Red Hand has been imposing their will. The ones who attacked you? Yes and no. They are bandits, but someone is controlling them. Look no further than the names in that letter. Killing them is the reason I'm here. But they are coded. They could belong to anyone. The sludge in the streets often drips from the gutters of the halls. When in doubt, look to those in power. You mean the Council? Hjord is on the Council. That works in our favor. Someone we can trust to find the answers we seek. Yes, we are nearly there. It pleases me to see you, old friend. All are welcome here in Jorvik. It's good to find you well, Jor. Both of you. What are you doing here? You have not come all this way for the Yuletide. I've come to warn you, old warrior, about a rut in your city. Three figures, corrupt and dangerous. We should work together to bring them into the light and kill them before they come to power. However I may help, I am ready. Slow yourselves. Eivor, we cannot just go running around the city, poking and prodding and killing at will. They nearly did me, Jor. What? These people sent the Red Hand after her, ready to shed blood in your streets to keep themselves a secret. But they failed. Uh, this is the letter that was sent to our home. The Needle, the Firebrand, the Vault. They belong to a group called the Order of Ancients. These are their assumed names. Our leads. Listen to him, Jor. He has dealt with their kind before. Corruption has seeped its way into Jorvik. But King Rishie's hands are full, which means my hands are full. Counsel on this matter will fall on deaf ears. I do not want his counsel. All I have told you stays between the three of us. But you should introduce me to the king. I will need to align with him if we are to go about this freely. are winning this war. We should be scraping together every ounce of silver to procure food for our men. Understood, dear Farafid, but we also have a responsibility to our townspeople. The Yuletide must go on. Enough. The more you argue, the more my head hurts. Kyo, I was not aware we had company, the likes of which I did not approve. You have a problem in Jorvik? Yes. I'm looking at it. A problem that nearly got my friend killed. Lufina was attacked by the Red Hand. They raided her home, destroyed her property, and chased her through the streets. Those bloody scoundrels again! She survived. But the Red Hand has been a growing problem here of late. And what is your stake in this? He's some sort of wandering mercenary? No. This is Sigurd Jarl's Drenger. Took our old camp by the River Nene, as I hear it. I am far away then. War chief to Haftan Ragnarsson, and this well fed wastrel is Aldun, High Reef of Jorvik. I have seen rebel groups like this before. They sit and wait, and the moment you lower your guard, they spring up like weeds. If left alone, they will take Jorvik out from under you. Not what you want, not what Haftan wants. Oh dear. 
What do you want? Tell me what you know about the Red Hand, and I will rid your city of them. You can go about your affairs. They've been sticking their hands in coffers around the city, targeting nobles, merchants, and anyone else they can throttle. And they are growing, as you said. I would rather not be worrying about them come Yuletide. This is not something we can afford to ignore. If we do not have the means to deal with the Red Hand, we should let Eivor... Do what you can, but do it quietly. I do not want the public alarmed. Pure. Send funds to procure food and ale for Faravid's men. And make sure there's enough left over for the feast. But it's as I said. We don't have... Find it. I have spoken. He tells me to find more silver. Where? In a dragon's hoard? Come. I will take you back to Lufina. She will know where to begin. This is, getting, this is getting really interesting, guys. I cannot tell if that went the way you had hoped. It went well enough. Rishay will stay out of my way. No one can argue the Red Hand must be dealt with. Speak a word of this to no one. The circle of trust must stay between the three of us. I have a feeling that that king is, uh, you know... You will forgive me for stepping away. I grow weary of those pissing contests. My love, I am sorry for what happened. I should have been there. Nonsense. You have your duties to fulfill. Besides, a few bandits is hardly something to worry over. I am only glad you were not harmed. Eivor, I will be around if you need me. Once you catch the tail, you do not let go. Old habits die with the struggle. Yours changed. Softened. Politics. It takes the Norse out of a Norse. I'm happy for him. And you as well. You have made something of yourselves here. Perhaps. What do you have there? Christian texts. The Gospels. Ecclesiastes. The Revelation of John. The Red Hand steals all they can find. We may run the city now, but the Christians must still be allowed to worship as they see fit. Seems the Red Hand disagrees. What's more, Althon is worried they will come for the Archives next. Between this and all the uproar at the harbor, I would say we have some leads. What does the Red Hand want with Christian texts? That is the question. Whatever it is, there is no length they will not go to to retrieve them. They have even burned people alive who refuse to hand over what they demand. Where is the largest collection of texts in the city? The Archives. But they haven't been so bold as to attack it yet. Aldon keeps a close eye on the place. I will try my luck there. I went by the harbor when I first arrived. The Duckmaster looked wary when I asked about you. That does not surprise me. He's been using Jorvik's money shortage to increase taxes. As if he's been ordered to by the Council. Yor would never wrong the people like that, even if Rishie demanded it. The Dark Master is a thief and a liar. A man in need of a throttling. I will have another look around the harbor. Try the Trade Depot. It's where he's holding the merchant's wares. I'll get started at once. Well, guys. No, let's... I need you here. Listen to the voices in this hall. Look for any signs. Changes in behavior. Anything. I would swallow a horse heart to join you, Eivor. I know, old friend. Your loyalty is why I need you here. I will return when I find something. Shuffles the council papers. It's not here. Hmm. 
Weapons and supplies. But not enough to arm and feed even the smallest army. I should look around. It's like a piercing shot. Sign. Uh, let's do... Thank you, Auden. I will leave with these at once. Of course. A4, isn't it? What brings you to our archives? I've come to ask about these Christian texts. Lufina tells me the Red Hand is stealing them. Mm, and destroying them? I fear they will attack these archives next. The Abbess here has offered to bring the texts somewhere safe. She's been working diligently on this matter. You flatter me, Lord. I only wish to help. Abbess Ingeborg, this is Eivor, our honored guest from the south. Eivor has offered to help rid Jorvik of the Red Hand. How can I help? Uh... You say you're keeping the text safe. Where? Forgive me, Eivor, but as an outsider, I do not understand your stake in this. For that, I am reluctant to trust you. The texts are safest with me. I will do what I must to guard them from the Red Hand. I admire your resolve. But unless the Red Hand is dismantled, they will continue to harm those in possession of these texts. The Red Hand seems to know where to look for these texts. It may be someone is guiding them. What can you tell me? You know something else. That much is clear. The Abbess has her suspicions. As much as it pains me to say, I suspect something foul at the Rectory. I have heard whispering, collusion, and the Bishop. He has been sneaking around the Rectory, often visiting the priests in the cover of night. Time I pay these men of faith a visit. The Rectory is on the road to the Minister. 
Bro, do you trust I should him? look for the bishop there. I have the Yuletide feast to prepare for as well. Uh, do drop by for the festivities, A4. Have a drink too. Thanks, buddy. I don't know, this girl seems sketch too. I think the king, that chick, and the bishop are in on it. No! Ouch! My suspicions. Ouch! Those are my suspicions. No, I really do think that, uh, the girl might be in on it. Is such a suspected secrecy among the priests and bishop seems quiet. Where is everyone? Benita. Ah, enough. Ah, leave me be, please. What has you doused in sweat and trembling so? The, the red hand. They're everywhere. Please, I don't want any trouble. Looks as though everyone else has fled this place. So why are you still here? Waiting for the bishop. One of our brothers said he would return soon. That's all I know, I swear it. Where's this other priest? He's locked himself in. That house, just there. Someone is hiding in there. Doubt he'll come out. I'll have to find a way in. Too often, guys. <laughs> Try to go into a house. No! Stay away from me! S stay back! Ah! Musky. Been here long, priest? Just who do you think you are, trespassing like this? This is my property you've destroyed. I'm looking for the bishop. Where is he? Gone to his quarters. Said he would return once he finished tending to a private matter. But that was some time ago. Show me there. W what do you mean to do with him? Now. Lord, forgive me. I knew I should have left with the others. <sighs> the bishops. No, so, where'd this guy go? The bishop's courses. What is that burning smell?
Lunt. That was a struggle here. I see the, uh, the guy on the ground. Several Christian texts. The Abbas was right to cast suspicion the bishop's way. Charred letter beneath the body. He must have tried to hide it before he died. Ugh, the stench. He looks like searcher's shit. Interesting. Someone knew the bishop was conflicted and killed him before he could say a word. It's a confession. The bishop played a part in destroying these texts against his own will. The rest of the letter is burned, but makes mention of the minster and the abbess. Is that why she's been keeping these texts? Look around. Search every room. They're around here somewhere. It's them. It's the Red Hand. Oh, Lord of mercy. Quiet. Red hand. I need to leave.
What do you think you're doing? This is no place for you, priest. Go. Now. Blasphemy! Stop this at once! Something troubling you, father? Abbess, look. They are burning all of these passages. Why are you not stopping this? I knew it. Because I ordered them to. What? The vellum that burn before you are covered in lies. So long as they exist, you cannot hope to see the world the way it truly is. Lies? Abbas, what has happened to you? We are God's children all. Do not renounce him like this. Please, I beg of you. You can still repent. God will forgive you. You know he will. Your mind has been poisoned, but worry not. We have the antidote. We will set a new example to which all may aspire. You... you... you're mad! You won't get away with this! I won't let you! There is no one to tell. No one who will hear your cries. If you cannot bear to watch them burn, then you should burn with them. I want it all destroyed! Every text, every passage, every scribbled piece of paper, everything. It is time to end this. Yes. Firebrand. Ah, oh, that's why we call her Firebrand. Makes sense. She has three women that look alike. Great, so she has doubles. The Abbess is the Firebrand. She'll kill whoever stands in her way. Time to get between her and her next victim. fire that burns inside. I've always had it. A longing to do something grand and important. But that door was always shut to me. My methods deemed too severe. I was cast out. Shunned. Scorned. But the Order, they took notice of me. Saw that it was courage that drove me. Courage to change the world for the better. They reopened that door. And you used your chance to destroy a way of life you did not support. We have seen time and time again what happens when people are left to interpret for themselves. Knowledge must be controlled. Only then can the message be widely understood. The day where there is but one truth draws nearer. One truth, that is what the Order offers. This one sought to spark a new flame, but did so with a heavy hand, not a teacher's tongue. This cleansing of yours ends here. My work is incomplete, but not inconsequential. There are others who carry on, for one of the four is us. Why did you say that? What does it mean? Now I go. A flame that grows bright and burns ever more, ever light. To Helheim, where cold and cruel the fires await. I 
she returned to Lufina. She'll want to know about Abyss Ingeborg's movement. part of the oh my gosh wow yep and then that king well 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 Alright guys, so I'm going to end this video real quick right here and then we'll start it in the next video. So guys, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, leave a comment, tell me what you guys want to see. I appreciate all the support. Thank you guys so much for watching, sharing, and uh, as always guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Take care. Peace.